My mom's calling me, is it? Hey, Ma, I'm in the middle of something right now. I'm Noah Centineo, and this is live life advice. I have absolutely no grounds to be giving anyone advice on anything. Stream after laughter. At Noah Cent, hi. I like this boy who's two seats behind me in this restaurant. How do I ask for his number without failing miserably? Okay, here's the thing. Probably gonna fail miserably. Most best things happen out of failure. You get up, walk over, you say, uh, hi, Candle Tui. Hi, I'm Candle Tui. Uh, really nice to meet you. Hey, I couldn't help but notice that I would love to go out to coffee with you or go out to a restaurant with you. Or you just ask them out. Count to three and then just do it. Hey, I know a cent. Just wondering what you like for breakfast so I'll be prepared. Well, Carly, I love oatmeal with bananas and granola and almond butter, a little bit of honey and coconut oil. Thanks. At Gabrielle Jr. says, hey, Noah Scent, is 26 too old for a 22 year old? Hashtag asking for a friend, smirk, winky face. Uh, no, it's actually a little young for a 22 year old like myself. <laughs> At Harry underscore liar, great feed name, even though your name's Vivian. I have a very important question to ask you. Do you like Harry Potter? Well, Vivian, uh, I do. I've read all the books and I've seen all the films. Hey, at Noah Scent, you're cute and all, but when are you going to figure out how to put your sweater slash jacket on correctly? Uh, Tyler, never, because I do it correctly already. You're just doing it wrong. <laughs> Hello, it's me, Dana. Hey, at Noah Scent, how do you get over a heartbreak when you still love the person that left you? Focus on yourself. If you love someone, like truly love someone, I don't think that ever goes away. But what does change is your perspective on the relationship and the dynamic. And for me, one of the best ways to you don't really get over someone, but to move through and past someone is to really focus on yourself. Rediscover yourself. Do things that you like to do, things that make you happy, things that make you feel empowered uh, and inspired. For me, it was reading, uh, learning that I actually do like working out, hiking, meditation, yoga, um, hanging out with my friends who care and, and love me dearly and who I love. Over time, you'll wake up one day and the heartbreak won't be as bad. At Layla H. Maslow says, at no ascent, what is your idea of a romantic date? You know, I think there's many different environments and places you could go to have a romantic date. I would say that what makes a date romantic is, is the care and the connection with the person and it being uh, very, very sincere. Now, we have Janelle Conti. I heard you like to read. Can you please provide us a list of your top 10 books? I'm gonna give you five because 10 books is just so many for a reading list, unless you really love reading too, in which case, kudos. Um, I would say The Alchemist, Celestine Prophecy, um, Shantaram, Mastery of Love, and The Four Agreements. So there you go, Mastery of Love. Oh, no, no, okay, five, but I have more. Uh, a great book by Osho is Love, Freedom, and Aloneness, The Cone of Relationships. Uh, he has one that's Trust, he has uh, Intimacy, and then he has Book of Women. Story of B by Daniel Quinn. And a bonus one, Ishmael by Daniel Quinn. Uh, hey, at Noah Sent, I absolutely loved your film, your movie. I have watched it quite a few times over the past week. Uh, I have to turn in a senior quote soon. Can you help me out? Grace, my darling, thanks for watching the film. I hope you really like it. That makes me really happy. Um, and a good quote would be, life without failure is a blank canvas. How can I get myself a man as sweet as you? Any tips? Um, <laughs> I would say just work on yourself. Be like super sweet and like do things that you love to do and like try to find that sweetness inside of you and then you'll attract it to yourself and you'll be good. <laughs> Recommend some songs for me. Need some inspiration. Hashtag Noah Centineo, hashtag pretty please, hashtag inspiration, hashtag music. Oh, no way. All right, so new band, The Night Game. They literally just released their album. I've had it on pre-order this entire time and I just found out the whole album was released. This is very exciting for me. We're discovering this together. So The Night Game, Tycho, T-Y-C-H-O, the album Awake, Andrew Bayer in My Last Life, uh, specifically the song Tidal Wave, Dennis Lloyd, Playa, parentheses, Say That. It's a good song. People, people are laughing at us right now for this conversation. It's a fantastic song. <laughs> Jessica Radloff, how do you manage stress now that you're being pulled in a million different directions. How do you prevent yourself from being totally overwhelmed? Very, very simple. Uh, I don't. 
I'm super stressed and I'm super overwhelmed and there's nothing I can do except just pretend that I'm really happy with my life. No, just to answer your question, I just spend a lot of time with friends and, and doing things that I enjoy doing and it, taking baths. I've taken more baths in the past two weeks than I have in my entire life. You're an actor, obviously. I was wondering how do you get your name known to film industries? Is this something you should pursue in first? I'm an aspiring actress and wish to get even, even a tiny role in a movie. Is there any advice you would give me? Uh, it's honestly, Holland, it's a really tough industry to break into. I started when I was eight and I was very fortunate because I got an agent when I was eight years old. Find representation that believes in you and that fights for you or even someone who just believes in you who can put you in certain rooms and introduce you to people. Like I said, I have absolutely no grounding or reason to be giving you any advice on anything, but I hope that uh, me answering some of your questions helped in the slightest bit. Okay, I love you guys so much. Thank you, Mwah. bye.